Energy. Hit music only. All right, guys. Welcome to the Energy Star Talk with the Vamps. Hello. Hello. How, are How are you guys? Good. How are you? I'm so good. good. Glad to have you here, guys. <laughs> it's very good to be, be here. Yeah. It's nice to be in Berlin. It's a. I've got my old grey tea. Yeah. Very British. Yes. Yeah, very. Very. How do you yeah. drink it? With lemon? With you, milk? Uh, no. No. So. Uh, lemon. You don't hang about. You put the tea leaf in. Rosie. You leave it in. You don't touch it. You don't hang a bat with the, with the tea leaves, and then you add two and a half sugars, milk. And voila! It's sweet as fuck. We did. We just. We just <laughs> all right. Oh, yeah. We just. <laughs> and then we just do that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so it's basically a stupid thing to talk about band names, but in this case, I have to, unfortunately. How do you say it in British? We would say the va- the vamps, the vamps, the vamps, vamps, yes. the vamps, vamps obviously. Yeah. Yes, the vamps. W- what does it mean? It means sexy women in German, doesn't it? Vamp is a sexy. Yeah, lady, we, we say it? like, uh, for example, we would say Angelina Jolie. She's a vamp. She, she is, is a vamp. vamp. She's, She's a great. big vamp. Yeah. What yeah. does make you vamps? <laughs> big vamp. What makes us vamps? <laughs> uh, we like to think we've got nice legs. Yeah, that, that. Yeah. 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 skinny yeah. jeans. We got J's. We got yeah. baggy We got J's. Loads of J's. Loads of J's. And we got uh, we got blonde, blonde hair. So, but um, no, the vamps was just uh, and and it was when me and James were writing very early on, and we just wanted to start thinking of band names, and vamps was one of the words we came up with. It's a really boring story, to be honest. Mm. That's it. Yeah. So you just came up with it, and yeah, basically. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So obviously that's it. Yeah. You guys are pretty young, between 19 and 21 years, if I'm yeah. informed yes. correctly. So probably what you do is not what parents want their kids to do in their life. They love, be surprised. I know they love, you know, getting us out of the house. <laughs> um, uh, <laughs> that was not the question. They're very actually. proud of us, and uh, we we love them. Yeah, I don't think we get up to much though. We're not too bad. So do they come to your shows and watch you? Yeah, that yeah, all the time. Yeah. Yeah. You guys found yourselves over YouTube. How did that go? Um, I saw a video of Brad singing um, an Ed Sheeran cover. And uh, we, Brad was only just 15. turned 15. And it was a very, very cute little bear. <laughs> so uh, I thought that was, <laughs> that was lovely. <laughs> I did this to my screen. <laughs> and then uh, we started writing together. We made contact via social media. And then... Uh, we started writing and then we saw a video of Tristan drumming uh, in a drumming competition and thought he was great in a Hawaiian shirt and a little rabbit. So we got Tristan, asked him if he wanted to join our duo and he said yes, luckily. Uh, And then we wanted to kind of go on tour and uh, make the band a a full band with electric guitars and things. So we needed a bass player and then Condor, uh, Condor the Explorer Explorer, uh, sort of was learning bass at the time and he's amazing now at bass. So I don't know. Wow, yeah. He was the, yeah. oh, the last piece oh. of the puzzle. Oh. So that's how you found yourselves. So you play the drums. Mm-hmm. Seems like you're pretty good at rhythms because you, you have like a very unusual pet, right? I, I, I do have an unusual pet. I have a horse. Is that the question? Yeah. How, how does that come? Like, what, what do you girls <laughs> say about a guy who, who's like a musician in a in kind of a boy group and owns a horse? It's like, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. I, uh... Good God. Guys can have horses as well. That is, really. yeah, it's a hard question. Um, um, I loves horses. Yeah. I've uh, been brought up with a very rural background um, who loved horses. He did. He does. <laughs> I'm a bit scared of horses, to be honest. Royal You're scared of horses? <laughs> <laughs> well, that's scared, the but they're royal. too big for me. Like, I have to be bigger than an animal to be yeah. that scared of it. It's not like yeah, a dog. <laughs> yeah, but, but still, you know, I, I got kind of a scar on my finger. I was bitten by the dog of my oh, granddad. Oh, it's like, it's ridiculously <laughs> the small. Dough. Yeah, um, the but dough. still, since Go then, sweat. I was like, okay. What kind of dog was it? I don't know. It was just like... Stupid bastard dog. <laughs> He's loving it. Loving yeah, it was just a little, little stupid brown dog. I don't know, oh, Fraser or whatever. Born, uh, <laughs> I hate the dog. The dog. Yeah, I hate Borat, it. Borat, Borat. <laughs> go, 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 ghost. Speaking of embarrassing experiences, is there yeah. something very embarrassing that happened to you? A you story with fans exactly. or something? Wait, I've, no. I've heard about like. A few of you guys have been seen oh, naked yeah. by fans. Who was not it? Fully it was not, no, yeah. <laughs> not fully naked. I can confirm that it was naked. We were all naked. Yeah. And uh, 
<clears throat> we were walking through the street naked <sighs> uh, on a on a late night slash early morning. The naked mile. Yeah, we did the did naked, the naked mile. mile. You did the, the naked mile from the venue to the hotel room. <laughs> Why did you do that? Well, it's uh, <laughs> it's things you have to do in this industry yeah. to um show your penis. <laughs> yes, to uh, get Some you point, get yeah. you in the game. We didn't really <laughs> yeah, know. Yeah, yeah. We had me and Connor in a so, hotel right? room, um, mm. close to being Come naked, to and then in fan, the underwear. In the underwear, and then fans ran into the room. That was the oh, that God. was the closest they've seen us to being naked. Yeah, yeah. it's quite scary. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah. How how did that happen? We just had our door like on latch, and um, they somehow got onto our floor, and then they got past up. security, and um, we didn't have security crazy. at the time. Yeah, yeah. Just... yeah Who's the biggest <laughs> mama's boy in the band? Right. You? Yeah, I'll take that hands down. I love my mum as well. We all love our mums. Yeah, we but, all um, I love my mum. But I'd, I think, because like, I guess, like, I'm like, Brad, you go home the most, don't you now? Yeah, yeah. Us. So, yeah. like, you, I, I've I'm sort still of, with my it's like I've sort of moved out of my house and, like, get to a point where you don't see her as much. It's, <laughs> God. Yeah, we all, we all love mums, but Brad likes calling his mum. Okay, guys, I got a few sentences for you, and I would love you to continue them. Okay. If you guys could travel in time, yeah. then I'd go back and see the dinosaurs. Yeah, I, agree. I would love to do that. So I'd Just go back and invent me. Apple. Oh, and meet even Steve that. Jobs. <laughs> Imagine. Yeah. That's pretty creative. Yeah, well, I'm just, you know, investing for the future. So, so you you would find out how the iPhone works today, well, and then I'd, travel I'd back know, in time I'd, and come yeah. up with all those ideas. Yeah, yeah, you could yeah. take the iPhone back and say, "Look what I made." Yeah. 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 Well, that's yeah. true. Great idea, guys. <laughs> Thank, you. Thank you. When girls throw their underwear on stage... You sometimes mm. slip on them. Yeah. Really? Yeah, yeah I, I slipped the other day. Do you guys pick it up? We kind of kick it to the side. <laughs> it's, it's, so you know, rude. You don't know where it's been. Yeah. Well, we know <laughs> where it's been. Guess, but, it is. Yeah. You don't know how bad where it's been is. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Does it does it happen quite often that girls throw like bras on the then stage? We get pants, really. We've, We've got, got a, a bra, yeah, yeah, bra, as many really. bras, and uh, they do get they do lob them, lob them. It was a massive bra. The I other got day. It was like this big. Oh, I got hit in the crotch with a waffle the other day, and it a, uh, a blue one. It, it did somehow <laughs> penetrate. <laughs> oh, Jesus! Yeah, first world band problems, right? Oh, no, it's <laughs> and. Uh, if you guys could break all the rules in the world for just one day, what would you do? It's like the purge. Oh. Well, peace. No, um, <laughs> uh, <laughs> break um, all the rules. Skate where I like skateboard yeah, where I always to get school. told off to skateboard. You guys are good skateboarding. He's good. Yeah, these well, guys are good. Really BMX, really I'd ride like a go kart around Tesco, like a shopping. Mm. Tesco. Oh, just oh, knock everything God. down like dominoes. Go kart. That's a great idea. Absolutely. Go with, with a go kart through the shopping center. Yes. yes. I'll yeah. Yeah. That. We should do that. I'll get the we hook up. Should do that. Go go kart. It'll be a fun day, right? Yeah. Yeah. You can come. Yeah. It'll be good. Go kart. Sure. Through Westfield. All right, guys. So basically, that's it. Thank you for the interview. Thank you very much. It's been fun. Have a good day and uh, all the best for, for your tour. I think you're touring right now, right? Yes. yes, we will. Uh, the tickets are on sale now. We're looking for the tour, which is in like four months. It's not long it's next year. year. Album's out soon as well, which is exciting. Yeah. Second album this what, month. What date's that, Brad? It's the 27th of November, which okay. is exciting. Okay. So hopefully people enjoy that. All right, so all Thank the best you. for you guys. Thank, Thank you very much. Thank, Thank you. you. Hits music only. Energy. Hits music only.